Hello everybody, this is the Benjinator, and welcome back to Let's Play Saga Frontier. This is T260G's Quest Part 3, and we've arrived in Scrap. Yes, we've, we have uh, once again arrived in the uh, explorable world, the regions. We're out of junk, uh, and actually if you try to leave, once again, uh, 2,000 or 10,000 credits, so that's kind of an implication that you're supposed to be here. Um, but if that's not enough evidence, there was also the fact that we've been talking about Caballero, and as we know from Riki's quest, this is where he hangs out. So, let's, uh, before we actually go into the office, I, I should let you know that if you want to do the junk shop trick, you totally can right now, because we got the money to do so, but, uh, we're gonna wait on that. We're gonna, we're gonna wait a little bit before we do, we go there. So, you know, you can still go to the inn and everything, but... As we all know, when you come to Scrap, one of the places you want to go is the bar. It's the pub. Yep, and of course, Gen's excited because he's Gen. And Gen can be a teetotaler for about two minutes. That's about it, so let's talk to everybody. Oh, loot, how's it going, my friend? Oh, mechs ha like uh, specialized booze. Motor oil. Collecting data. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, you know. Yorkland and this place aren't that much different. They both have an appreciation for alcohol. <laughs> What's my story? Oh boy, T260. Yep, mech with a lost mission. And can you believe it? He's uh, he's not joining you. Isn't that crazy? This is the only time that loot actually doesn't join you is in uh, T260's quest. Isn't that nuts? All right, let's uh, talk to our friend here. Ah, yeah, he's interested in us, because he works in the uh, robotics factory. Yep. Got any uh, data from me? Woo! <laughs> What's going on? Ooh. Okay, so, yeah, we might, we might have to run some diagnostics. Go to Nakajima Robotics. There we go. <laughs> oh, he's the president. That's crazy. <laughs> ah, well, that place is pretty cool. Ah, okay. So that's the little guy going up against a big corporation. Well, I'm I'm all behind you. Yeah, definitely. We're gonna we're gonna check you out. What's up, Gen? All right, so we're not we're not ready quite yet. What what's going on? <laughs> yeah, how did you do that? How did you cut that rope with that that, that pipe with that rope? <laughs> Incomprehensible. Wait. <laughs> yeah, there there are worse things. Oh, what, what the... Uh, <laughs> oh, that's a funny conversation. What's up, Mei Ling? How you doing? Woo, chunk of iron. Caballero. Oh, right, yeah. Cab yeah, Ricky's looking to face him, too, about the ring. Yep. Yeah, but this time you're going to be joining us. We're not going to be joining you. All right, let's go get him. Woo! All right, let's go after him. That sounds like fun. Woohoo! Riki joined the party, and so did Mei Ling, and they have their, you know, usual, usual stuff. I think Riki's, yeah, Riki's a tiny bit more powerful. Mei Ling's got Quip Draw, which is awesome. Alright, so, again, we're ready to go. Let's go! Yep. Okay, so yeah, now you actually have to leave for him to join you. <laughs> As usual. Gen's coming with us. So, looks like only the three of us are gonna be, uh, four of us are gonna be joining. Let's go talk to Caballero. What's he up to? Yep. He's the one with the fancy hat. Hmm? Alright. I don't want you to leave junk alone. That, that still sounds so wrong. Everything about this. <laughs> Some wino. Now, I think, uh... I think Gen's more of a... More of a Jack Daniels type guy, actually. <laughs> we're gonna have to make them listen. We're gonna use the show of force. That's what we're gonna do. Yep. And that they were pretty easy too. It was a bunch of crappy skeletons and xenos. It was it wasn't that hard. Oh yeah. We're a gutsy robot. We don't experience fear. It hasn't been pro it hasn't been uh yeah, programmed. Alright, so he's inviting us to the factory once again. Uh oh. His men are a little bit scared. That was the discussion. Alright. So we're gonna go back to the factory. This is exciting. Yep. This is starting to look familiar, isn't it? Yep. <laughs> Mei Ling's like, no, we got we got some we got some stuff to take care of. Secret weapon. Da -dun. He's got big lasers. Yeah, see, we're 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 all set. 
Even though we're, you know, a scrap heap and we might have crappy stuff. Secret weapon and a drunk. Well, drunks do have secret weapons. Alright, now it's playing the awesome music again. How exciting. Let's go to the factory. Oh, look, loot just came out of there. Awesome. So here's a nifty little thing. You want to go in here. And, uh, last, you want to actually fight this little, uh, slime. The two, uh, henchmen are coming down, so let's fight them. Alright, that was easy enough. Look! It's loot! Yep, there he is. The story sounded interesting. Alright. So now he's gonna join us. So now we got we got the full five. Just like last time. Circumstances are a little bit different. Uh, there are more enemies in these little uh, little houses and things like that. So that makes it a little different. Let me just show you if you go in here. There's a bunch of dudes. And there's a money bag. Oh no! They found us. Alright, but that was totally worth getting 400 credits. So first of all, I have to make sure to equip Gen with something. Because <laughs> right now he's just been punching people, which is not that useful. So, uh, yeah, I got the backpack for him. That's That should be fine. Yeah, this is this is about as good as it gets for now. We're kind of this ragtag bunch of poorly equipped, fairly weak party members going after a Caballero. But you have no choice. Just like it was with Ricky's quest. Kind of puts you in there. Alright, so now we got a lot of guys in here. And get down here. Kukari Blade! So let's uh, give this to... Again? No. Yeah, let's give it to, actually, Loot Boy, because it's going to be a little bit better. So, there we go. Perfect. Now, let's get out of here. Woo! Run around. Perfect. All right, so now that we've gotten all the available treasures, I'm going to auto-save just in case I mess this up. And this is this should look familiar to you. You just want to go to Caballero. So, the, uh, the best way to deal with this is to just, yep, deal with that dude who's a pain. Now, thankfully, we got Riki to turn into a platoon puss, who should be, uh fairly useful for the upcoming battle, so we're just gonna sneak up here. Quick save once again. There he is. There's Caballero. There's that bastard. And we're gonna have to fight uh, Vulcan 2. Similar battle as before. Hopefully we'll have the same luck, because last time it was actually quite easy to get rid of these guys. So this is something that we have seen before, but uh, you know, it's, it's not a bad thing to do it a second time, I don't think. So enemy fire. We're gonna be doing a lot of damage to Ricky, actually. That's because uh, Ricky tends to be vulnerable to that, but he had, does have a lot of HP, which is awesome. Uh, and for now, we're actually going to be using the easy rifle. I want to kind of save the uh, save the heavy stuff for later. Okay, so we can only use tail. Might as well. Uh, sharp shot. Actually, now we want to use the sun ray because that's that's a little bit more useful. Get rid of these detractors. Um, yeah, Kari blade. So just hope for the best. You never know what's gonna happen. Ooh, that did a lot of damage, actually. Boom. Yeah, that guy got stunned and that guy got deflected, so that's looking pretty good. And that guy's dead, all right. Death is always nice. Double slash, always a lot of damage. We're gonna sunray melt that guy, hopefully. Yeah, look at that. Ooh, I hate when that happens, that's gonna hurt. All right, so actually, uh, let me see. How we doing? Um, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have our friend T260G use a, uh, want to heal Riki. Actually, we want to heal Gen, I think. Gen's a little bit more vulnerable. He's, he's our, he's our man. He's, he's got the, the big-ass sword, so. Triple thrust, um, not triple thrust. I wish I had triple thrust. Sunray, Kari Blade. So this guy, of course, is not too hard, but any, any little bit helps, and, oh yeah, that's not bad. Stunned! Smash! Smash! Which is really good, because we're, we're gonna use Gen in the future. A lot of these, uh, the rest of these characters we're probably not going to be using. Alright, there we go. Easy enough. So once again, Caballero has been humiliated and defeated. Vulcan 2, recharged. I was hoping to get a technique off him. Unfortunately, this time, spoiler alert, we will not be getting a ring from this dude. Which is a shame, because that's always useful. Ah, well. Alright, alright, alright. We'll leave junk alone from now on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it just sounds so funny when he says it. All right. Yep. Gonna help him out. All right. So now we can. Um, I don't. I don't know about that ship thing because that lady still charges if you try to get out of there. Again, looking all slick, slick and gen like. All right. Awesome. So, ah, there we go. We've taken care of that business. So, we have uh, once again. Shamed Caballero, which means that we can now get out of the uh, the region of scrap. 
So where will we go next? How else will our friend T260G find out what his lost mission is? Find out in the next episode of Let's Play Saga Frontier T260G's Quest. I'll see you guys later.